enforcers never come down here, so this is as good a place as any. <gasps> oh, I didn't even realize the foreshadowing right there! Giant fists! Hello friends, how are you doing today? It's your host with the most, Celeviathan here, back with another reaction today. Today we're continuing up Arcane Season 1, Episode 2. And last episode was a great, great setup episode. We meet Vi and Powder, for, also named, also known as Jinx in the future. And we kind of see like their little, um, the way that they grow up in uh, Piltover, over, you know. I like seeing that there's a darker side to Piltover and underground where, you know, the unwanted people all congregate. Um, you know, we, we meet uh, Vander, um, their father figure who basically taught them how to survive in the slums and stuff and we kind of see them pulling jobs and things like that they robbed the place right but they, they mentioned the name the Kiramans now that was bothering me because it, it felt familiar you know and I remember Caitlin's last name was Kiraman right we kind of have them um, you know saying that they stole something very dangerous and it looked as though like um, the the people on top were not having it you know they, they wanted somebody to take the blame for it so it looks as though like we're going to see a little bit more on how that happens I'm feeling like Vander's maybe going to sacrifice himself for them and that's gonna push them into different directions I'm really really excited to see this and when they age up because I want to know when everything kind of goes to shit in the last part of the episode we kind of saw the um, the opposition now when I looked at some of the characters there I thought it could have been Victor the person who was creating like the poisons and stuff but then part of me was like wait wait, wait there's another character in League that uses like poisons and like chemicals and stuff singed we also saw echo as well too so i'm hoping he's gonna start playing a little bit of a role as well too who knows but let's just get started with this reaction here don't forget to like share and subscribe turn on notifications down below man it's critical to know when i upload next and yo make sure you guys um leave a comment down below you know with your with your thoughts on the reaction here and honestly give, give me some uh, more recommendations i'd love to see what you guys would love to see me react to but we're not going to waste any time on this one. Let's get started with Arcane Season 1, Episode 2. Some mysteries are better left unsolved. Let's go. You really went to the Undercity to get these? Weren't you afraid? A little danger is worth the risk, don't you think? Huh? Yo, that's oh, Caitlyn! <laughs> that's your parents money dropping. Yo, she looks so damn young. <laughs> hey, open up! Did he get like sprung into like a like a memory? Wacko stuff is going on. This guy just introduced the whole like secrets of the universe. <laughs> what? <laughs> Amazing man, this guy literally took out and melted all the snow. It was it was just a blizzard. Yo, who is this powerful wizard? Amazing. That like that's some crazy power. Relax, kid. We know it was a break-in, but that doesn't explain this. There's a lot of restricted items here, and I don't see any permits. What happened here? Science, I guess. Last time I checked, science didn't require illegal <laughs> equipment. He sent me here to ensure that anything dangerous is removed safely, which, according to my list, includes you. Yo, what? young young Jace looks How so cool. He looks so much cooler than his like league counterpart. It, no lie, like his league counterpart looked kind of like a dork. I remember the first time I saw you at the academy. You reminded me of myself, a scientist. 
ready to forge a new vector of experimentation. Experimentation! I believe I've discovered something truly incredible. A way to harness magic through science. Magic? The arcane is dangerous, Jace. A force of nature. Science cannot control it. How old are you, my boy? I'm... I'm 24. He's, he's gonna figure it out though, for sure. Eventually he will figure it out how to do it. All my life I've pursued the mysteries of science. Only to discover some are better left unsolved. Enforcers never come down here, so this is as good a place as any. <gasps> oh, I didn't even realize the foreshadowing right there! Giant fists! If she didn't keep fixing these things, I wouldn't keep missing. You guys know I wouldn't take you on a job you couldn't handle, right? Are you kidding? That was the best job we've ever done! Maybe just don't take powder next time. Bruh, she's like so much better than this loser! Fuck Milo, man. Give me a name. <laughs> I love how they drew his lips. <laughs> man, <laughs> no. Dumbest thing this guy ever did, man. Dang, man. If that if they didn't throw that guy in there, they wouldn't have even known they were there. That's just some bad luck, man. Some real bad luck. You see, I like these enforcers. Last episode when they were like throwing those little like rope things. Nah, like this? Yeah, yeah, there we go. There we go. Good. Last time I was like, where the hell are their guns, man? <laughs> God. Excellent choice, Counselor Medarda. A supreme challenge, if I may. We need something revolutionary, Alora. Something to put Piltover on the map. What of today's trial? His name is Jace of House Talus. But Heimerdinger favors him? As far as I can tell. Hmm. This one. We need to help him. Caitlin's right. We've known Jace for years. Besides, we're his patrons. If anyone is meant to speak up for him, it's us. That is true. We should hit them back. We've got the numbers to beat them. Yeah, let's teach them what it means to mess with us. Yeah. We crossed that bridge once before. We all know how that ended. You're just protecting your kids. I'm protecting our people. The Vander I knew, the one who built the underground, wouldn't be afraid to fight. Do I look afraid? <coughs> no. You look weak. Jeez, even Powder wants to fight. So why aren't we? Mm, that that is true. That is true. Um, okay, well, um, Vander's gotta deal with the enforcers. What deal? Don't lock up my boy Jace! Don't! He was just trying to pursue science! And that is never a crime! The pursuit of science! Jace Talis. You are accused of illegal experimentation and endangering the citizens of Piltover. The materials were far more dangerous than I was aware of. And I, I now know my actions were against Academy regulations. As Jace's patron of many years, I can speak for his character. I believe that one day, he will be a great contributor to our society. He destroyed a building. It was revolutionary. Revolutionary how? All I see is a boy meddling with things he doesn't understand. The Academy seems to have loosened its standards. This is a fine line. I was trying to create magic. Now they're like, oof, I'm intrigued. <laughs> this guy's like, shit, my boy, shit. The arcane is the curse of our world. My race was nearly destroyed by it. Surely we, the pioneers of science, can use it for good. 
Think of the wonders we could create. Let me prove Enough! Damn, man. Out of everybody, Heimerdinger was the one saying shut up. I've seen this power in the wrong hands. It corrupts, consumes, lays waste to civilizations. Heimerdinger is right. Piltover was founded to escape the warmongering of mages, not cultivated. As a lower house, my voice doesn't carry much weight here. But as a mother... Oh, this is his mother, eh? Okay, that makes sense. My son isn't in his right mind. What? <laughs> but he has a good heart. Please, let him come home. A crime like this can't be overlooked. The boy must be punished. Perhaps in this matter, a lesser sentence may suffice. I move that Jace be summarily expelled from the academy and remanded to the care of his parents. Okay, all right, all right. Dang. <laughs> that guy's just a bitch boy in the council. <laughs> First time I've been invited to the lanes. It better be worth my time. Oh, you see, that's your weakness, Marcus. You carry your chin so high, you fail to see the opportunity below. You don't look so concerned. I'm about to make your day. Jace, please. If I hadn't spoken, you'd be lost to me. I had to say something. I could have convinced the council. If my own family won't help me, I'll find someone who will. Interesting. I wonder who he's gonna go to for help. That's that's actually looks sound like it'd be pretty important. Cause I don't think anybody above Piltover would be down with it. He might go to the underground. Admit his theory intrigues. If dangerous, I oh, Victor! Victor's here. Hold on. This is Victor. Really invoke. Is this the Victor robotic Victor Victor? There. Come tomorrow morning, his research will be safely disposed of. Lock up. No, no, no. Magic is far too dangerous and wrong. Beautiful, aren't they? Yet up there on the surface, no one even knows they exist. What? No. No, no, it'll kill me. You see, power comes to those who will do anything to achieve it. That is very, very true. It's time to let the monster out. Interesting. I have, a, I have a little bit of a theory here. Is is that little th chemical there the thing that created Warwick? Because I know Warwick was like, it used to be a human and turned into a monstrosity. Is this the thing that's making them into monstrosities? Your name's no good now. My dad says you're a misfit. And that we can't be friends anymore. What will you do? Join the Talus Hammer business, I guess. You can't do that. No, I can't. Come inside, Caitlin. Now. I'm sorry. I just wanted to explain. I think you've done enough. They're not treating this guy very fairly right now. I get he was he was like dabbling things that he shouldn't, but everybody's like shunning him right now. This mention of magic has the people afraid. The culprits must be apprehended. We're doing our best, Counselor, I assure you. Your attitude makes me question if your best is up to the task. Do whatever it takes. Turn the other city upside down if you have to. Just find them. Welcome to the last drop. Search the place. While you're wasting your time, how about a proper drink? I'll take the strongest shit you got. That's 
pretty cool. Nice little warning system. To an old friend of yours. <laughs> he had some stories. Yeah, well, you can't escape the past. Right? It's a shame if I had to put them on again. Ho 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 ho! Yeesh! Yo, she's trying too hard right now. You're standing up for something? But we all know there is a crime behind every coin that passes through this place. It's only a crime because you guys make the laws. That's why it's a crime. And I'm gonna bury the lot of you. Bro, I would not take that. You can't come up to our establishment and threaten us and then get to leave and walk away? Come on. They need to stand up. They gotta fight. You heard him. They won't stop. We need to fight back. And if you won't, I will. I've heard this kind of talk before. Why are we here? I grew up knowing I'm less than them. That my place is down there. I want Powder to have more than that, and I'm willing to fight for it. So was I. I was angry, just like you. I know you want to hurt the Topsiders for what they've done to us. But who are you willing to lose? Milo? Flagger? Powder? I mean, I'm willing to lose Milo. <laughs> Please, just get Milo out of here. <laughs> What are we going to do? The enforcers will come back. I... I don't know. I'll, uh, I'll figure it out. Okay, what is this guy trying to do here? There, there is no freaking way this guy tried to commit suicide right now. I was intrigued by what you said at the trial. That makes you the only one. This Hextech theory of yours. It's not a theory. I saw with my own eyes what magic can do. The lives it could save. A poor cripple from the Undercity. I was an outsider the moment I stepped foot in Piltover. Bro, I respect this guy. He came from the other Undercity, came into Piltover, and made something of himself. I, want to I respect that you. shit. No one thinks it can be done. When you're going to change the world, don't ask for permission. I don't even know your name. It's Victor. Fi, where you been? Rumor is the lanes are gonna fight. I made him for the enforcers. You know, Powder, what makes you different makes you strong. Always remember that, okay? What is Vi gonna do right now? I feel like she's about to go do something. Heard the council? You're a fool. There is no stopping what happens now. Maybe it's not too late. There's a girl in town and words gonna wear. Something feels like it's about to happen here. Something bad.
Vi turned herself in! Oh no! Bro, this is a W sister right here. This is a W right here. Oh man. She's gonna take on all the responsibility. Um, oh, I guess that's it there. Okay, guys. <clears throat> Good episode. I like that. Um, I liked how we we flipped on and we and we flipped on to the J side of things um, and didn't still keep focusing on Vi and and their group. Uh, noticed there were some more character lead characters introduced in here. You know, we got the introduction of Caitlyn, we got the introduction of Heimerdinger, and we got the introduction of Victor before he he kind of changes up and, and makes himself into like a robot. I like the fact that um, Jace was kind of learning how to harness arcane energy and create a scientific way to produce it, right? Um, Heimerdinger, him kind of feeling very abrasive about it kind of made a little bit of sense. It seems like he's seen some shit. Like he's seen the fact of like the result of what the hell happened happens when you kind of pursue this type of work and then at the very end we had that little moment where Vi was like we gotta fight and then I think actually after he talked to Amanda talked to her she started to think she's like you know what man I'm just gonna turn myself in right kind of kind of kill this and, and nip it in the butt it was kind of sad and I like how much she loves her sister you can kind of see it you can kind of see the how much she cares about her and she just wants to get have the best life for her create the best situation for her you know, we all know that doesn't happen, but it's good to know that Vi still kind of cares for her like that. The show has been great. It's on, honestly, it has been so great. <laughs> but I will see you guys around. Take care and have a great rest of your day. Bye.